Abbot Trifon is founder and abbot of All Merciful Savior Monastery on Vashon Island near Seattle, Washington. He wrote the book Morning Offering and blogs and podcasts regularly under that name as well. In October of 2018, I attended the annual conference of the Brotherhood of St. Moses the Black in Columbia, South Carolina, uh, where Abbot Trifon was the keynote speaker. I really enjoyed meeting uh, Abbot Trifon and uh, having the opportunity to spend some time with him, and he kindly agreed to sit down for an interview. So without further ado, I hope you'll enjoy this episode from my interview with Abbot Trifon. The God of the Christian is a God that respects our freedom. Uh, if, if we think about it, any kind of relationship has to be based on freedom. If a woman lives with her husband and her husband doesn't love her, but she stays with him out of fear, then there's not a, there's not a true relationship and it's not a relationship built on freedom, it's a relationship built on fear. Uh, if someone is uh, uh, treats their children, uh, you know, as, as sort of like you will obey me, uh, that's not the love. It would be like a father uh, saying to his daughter, "See this fist? You'd better love me, or I'm going to bust you in the face." That is not that anything she's going to give him back isn't going to be love. It's going to be submission and fear. Part of the freedom that we have as Christians that God has given us is the freedom to choose or not to choose. Um, if we choose to have a relationship with Christ, then we as free agents are saying, yes, enter into my heart, change me, transform me, illuminate my heart, illumine my heart. And that is a true entrance into a personal relationship that is based on love that comes out of that freedom of choosing or not choosing to have that relationship with God. Um, I think that we Americans put so much emphasis on, you know, the freedom of religion, the freedom of thought, the freedom of bearing arms and all of this stuff that we oftentimes lose the true meaning of what it means to be free. When we were created in God's image and likeness, uh, the image we had no choice. God created us. He didn't consult with us ahead of time and saying, would you like to be created in, into flesh and blood? He didn't ask us. He did it. But where we do have freedom is the second part. Freedom, uh, we are created in his image image and likeness. The likeness part is that is the part that requires our participation and our consent. And so we say, Lord, I want to enter into this relationship and I want you to transform my heart and make me holy. That's what I want. I want you to make me holy. I, I, I not only want to walk with you in submission to you as my God and my creator. But I want to be your adopted child. I want that intimate relationship with you that's going to change me so that eternity in the, in the river of fire, which is the fire of God, will not be a burning fire, but will, will be the fire of illumination. That requires our free consent we are consenting to have that relationship. And God in turn pours forth his grace upon us and transforms us and we experience theosis, which will allow us to spend eternity with the fire of God, the river of fire, and enjoy it and bask in it and let it be to us illumination. Hi again, hope you enjoyed this episode from my interview with Abbot Trifon. 
Please subscribe below to get notified when new episodes become available, which happens every Friday. And also, if you would, please comment below letting me know what you thought of this video. Have a great weekend, and we'll see you next week.